Hey guys, the CO100 Evil, and I'm just playing I Spy Mystery, and I'm just alpine this under fair use. And the Scholastic logo is sound. Well, that's really out of sync. Welcome back. Please type in your name or pick it from the list. Then click the Go button to begin. Yes, and I'll just put CO Abel as my name. Alright, let's get started. And here comes the intro screen. I Spy Mystery. Yeah, that's the name of the game. Welcome, players, to the game of I Spy. Here are 13 mysteries for you to try. Yes. And let's start off with Mystery, mystery Meal. Meal. And that's my favorite mystery. What's cooking in the creepy kitchen? I don't know. Find out after you solve these tasty I Spy riddles. Yeah. And let's start off with this one in the kitchen. Here's how to play I Spy. Listen to the riddle that's written on the paper at the bottom of the screen. It tells you what things to look for in this picture. Click the things when you find them. Here's your riddle. All right. I spy three cups, a cat that's gold, a flower, an egg, an apple, mold, the first bug in line, blue snail spice, a candle, a snake, and bug twice. Yeah, there's one cup. One cup. And there's the other one. Right here. Two cups. And there's the other one on the shelf. And, uh... Three and cups! And as of recording the clip, uh... Um, Cantation Recorder somehow, um... A stopped cat working that's during gold. the rendering, and, uh... I just opened the recorder here. Whoa, wait. How did the flies get out there? A flower. And I just opened the recorder again, and, uh... Let me think. Oh, hang on a sec again. Oh, green egg yolk. That looks creepy. An egg. And what I was going to say is that, uh, I just... An and apple. I just, uh, recovered the file, and saved it and imported it, but apparently it did not include the commentary, so I guess the software might be, Mold. Uh, might be acting like it's broken because of that, and, and, instead of just, uh, blowing this video without any commentary, I'm just doing a method to make post-commentary by the redoing, first bug in uh, line. my commentary. Whoa, blue snail spice. Blue snail spice. Blue snail spice. Hmm. And there's a candle in the basket full of bones. A candle. And there's a snake. A snake. Hmm. Bug spice. Bug. <laughs> bug once. And bug twice. On the bug mover jar and the bug spice shelf. Bug twice. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I did it. And I first played this game back in 2007. And this game was pretty cool. And all that. Let's do the next screen. And as you can tell, the game uses the I screen. spy a zebra. Use the Zero twice. I spy a yo-yo. A snake. And so is the a cheese slice. A candy heart. Two grapes that are loose. A magnet. A marble. And a red caboose. Yeah. A zebra. A zebra. Zero twice. Zero once. Zero on the pen, too. Zero twice. 
yeah, there's a yo-yo somewhere and on the screen, and where is it? Hmm. Wow. A yo-yo. Okay. A snake. Yeah. A cheese slice. Mm, a candy heart. A candy heart. And two grapes that are loose. One grape that is loose. Okay. I love that fanfare. And the two grapes that the are loose. The objects found fanfares have been changed for this game. Even though it just reuses the screens and riddles from the previous games. The magnet is animated. A magnet. And... Hmm. <laughs> a marble. A marble. It hit the frog. And a red caboose. A red caboose. All right. Let's do this one. I spy a toothbrush. Yeah, one a of button, my favorite screens. A nine. I spy a treasure. A cone on a clown. A cookie dough sign. An upside down flower. A red lollipop. A triple scoop. Fudge. And two cherries on top. Yeah, a toothbrush. How did it get here? A toothbrush. A button. A lollipop. A button. Ugh. A nine? A turn a nine. upside down into a six. A hat. A cone on a clown. Yeah, a cone on a clown. And a cookie dough sign. Right up here. A cookie dough sign. Maybe I guess the cookie dough flavor is out of order right now. Bell. Where's that upside down flower? Hmm, I forgot where it is. Also, uh, and I'm just gonna have to have all the parts on Let's Play extended up to 23 minutes and a half. But because of the fair use disclaimer being used, uh, I'm just gonna have to have parts up to 20 minutes, 24 a minutes. A red actually. lollipop. I just found the red lollipop for a sec. Now where's the upside down flower? Oh, I just had to a find a triple a scoop. scoop. And there's fudge. Uh. On the sign. Fudge. Now, where is that upside down flower? Oh, right here. An I upside never down to flower. Look above the cookie dough sign. And two cherries on top. One cherry on top. There's Cherry, another one. Wow. Two cherries on top. All right, we're finished with this one. And let's do this one at last. I spy two knives, two nuts, two flies, a berry face, a dime, four eyes. A heart that's sweet, a flower that's black, an ant all alone, and a ladybug snack. 
Alright. Mm, there's the first knife, which is a yellow one. One knife. And there's the other one on the the pirate on the pirate's camp. Two knives. Two fives. Whoa. One <laughs> nut. Just kidding. Two nuts. Two nuts. And two flies. One fly. Now, where's the other one? Has to be around here somewhere on the screen. Hmm. Oh, there it is. It's in, it's in the cup. Two flies. Yeah. A berry face. Right here. <laughs> a berry face. A dime. Where can that one be? This one. Right here. A dime. Four eyes. One eye. And that one? Two eyes. This one? Three eyes. Now, where is that other eye? I want to see it. Hmm. There's a late but snack. I had to find that one for a sec. A ladybug snack. A flower that's black. A flower that's black. Mm, I already found Two knives. knives. Now where's the other eye? Oh, it's on that cap. How did I forget about Four that? Four eyes. A heart that's sweet. Hmm, where is it? Tip on the cookie. A heart that's sweet. And an ant all alone. Hmm. An ant all alone. Ah, uh, yeah! We finally finished this one. Alright, and let's get out of here and finish the mystery. You finished all the riddles. Yeah. Now, here's your clue to solve this mystery. Okay, tell me what it is. A few ingredients are missing for the mystery meal. Find two yellow fruits that have great appeal. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. The bananas. This red ingredient tastes so nice. Please pick up a floating slice. Uh, yes.
It's a tomato slice. Find a different red slice on a plate. It will make the mystery meal taste great. All right. Hmm. The watermelon. For the last ingredient that is listed, find something that's brown and twisted. It's a pretzel. Right here on the same screen. You're ready to cook on the stove that's hot. Please put some snail spice in the pot. Okay. Alright, I'm now chef. Just have to put the blue spice in. Next, add the watermelon juicy and sweet to the steaming mystery treat. Okay, let's add the watermelon. It's now chopped up into pieces. Slice as I meant. Quick, it's the tomato's turn. Add it now so it doesn't burn. Okay. And there it goes. Two yellow fruits will make the meal swell. Have you figured out what the letters spell? Uh, I don't know yet, because this isn't like Wheel of Fortune. And I put the bananas in here. Now add the pretzel. It starts with P. What kind of meal will this be? I don't know yet. Finally put the pretzel in here. Finish with a jar that has three eyes to see the name of this tasty surprise. All right, I better figure out the name quickly. Yeah! I Spy Stew. Are you ready for a bowl of I Spy Stew? Yeah. Use the biggest spoon to serve some to you. All right. And let's get the bigger spoon to get it out. Mm. Looks weird. I wouldn't want to taste that. And we're all done with this mystery. Finally. This mystery is solved. Yes. <laughs> You've solved this mystery. I Press did. Press this button to return to the main menu and choose a different mystery. Yeah. And let's do Midnight, Midnight Mouse Where will the little mouse be when the clock strikes 12? Watch the time as you solve these I Spy riddles. Okay. I spy a full moon, a tail, three bows, this is a face with I no eyes, off with. a foot with no toes, a light switch, a heart, a crayon, a crown, my name, and a letter that's turned upside down. A full moon? A full moon. What? Uh, hmm. Where's that tail? Oh, it's right up here. A tail. Hmm. There's the first bow. One bow. Yeah. There's the other one on the teddy bear. Two bows. Where's the other one? Um, uh, hmm. Come on, third bow. I want to see you. Hmm. Where is it? Oh, it's right here on the rabbit. Three bows. A face with no eyes. Hmm. Where on earth is it? Oh, a full I moon. 
already moon. found that. Mm, this is going to be tough to find. Wow. I clicked on the crown. A crown. I just have to find that one for a sec while I find the face with no eyes. Mm, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Yeah. A face with no eyes. I forgot that it's just a clock. Where's the foot with no toes? <sighs> hmm... Maybe if I keep clicking around here, I might be able to find the foot with no toes. Now, where can it be? I already clicked on the crown. A crown. I know. Now, where is that, um, foot with no toes? A foot with no toes. Yeah, I know. That's what we still need to find. I already found a crown. A crown. I I know. Still. No. Oh, it's, it's just only a ruler. A foot with no toes. A light switch. Right here. A light switch. Yeah. The flashlight is turned on. Mm, where's the heart? Mm, where's it? Mm. Well, there it is. On the lollipop. A heart. Yeah! Yep, a crayon. A crayon. My name. And the letter that's turned upside down. My name. Which is a T. A letter that's turned upside down. Yeah! We finally finished the riddle in time to end the, this part of the play. Alright, Dan. In the next part, we're just going to do the rest of this mystery and finish it up and all that stuff. So, hmm, there's three more screens left to do. And it's time to take a break for now. So, that's about it.